Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Close Combat The Longest Day. And we're gonna continue the battle of La Vierre Causeway. And this is the battle, if I recall correctly, the one with the large open fields and the two Renault tanks that the Germans have taken from the French army in 1940. And I think it is. Okay, we have. The hedgerow here, pretty much. The, uh, what is it? Orchard, I think. Apple trees, stuff like that. We have parsley, only the victory point, so we might want to take this and get a continuous front going. The end goal is to get here. Now, this is pretty shit to get at. Just you're in the open, but I do suspect that a tank will be here. Might use it up here. Uh, yeah. Let's look at it. Yeah, they've got the two tanks. They have one MG42, two MG42, three MG42s. Crap. Okay, so there we are. Defensive capabilities are okay. I have a counter strike, but it doesn't really need too much. I hate the fact that I have these three. It seems like an overkill for two little tanks. But you never know, you might need it. Those tanks can really fuck up my day if I don't take them out. You know, there might be shitty Renault tanks, but they're still tanks. Let's let's leave them in there. Yeah, let's deploy. Okay. Where is my little gun? There is my little gun. I put my little gun. I put my little gun here. Right. Put it in defense. Now, how much it can? Take quite a bit of the field here, so that's nice. I'll have got a 30 cal. You guys are gonna go back into the bell tower here on um, ambush. I'm gonna put two units on either side of this, a rifle team and the other one. Uh, put them also in ambush mode. I want a bazooka team nearby. Maybe here in the bushes. Platoon HQ. We got a 60 mortar. Yeah, we might need that. In case of a counter attack. Put these guys in this little house here on. Defense, we have another HQ. We have two HQs, I think. Or three HQs, okay. So I'm gonna put one in here just for. Back up. Do we have any forces up here? We have got nothing up here. We have two. Down here, a bazooka team and a rifle team. Now, I'm not gonna put them here because they will get killed. But we're gonna take this, what is it? Valos Farm and this area right here. I've got a bazooka team here. I've got, uh, I think F6, yeah. Let's lose the. Okay. Don't want it to be a rush job. Don't think there are too much, too many German forces here, but you never know. Move fast, go on defense. You guys go on ambush, you guys go on ambush. Ambush. And G team goes on defense. And now let's put these guys into ambush mode. There is a tank here. It's gonna be a bad day for that tank. I think I have everything deployed. Right. 
Yes, I have. Okay, let's begin the battle. Ooh, that's a gun. Could you take a gun out, please? A lot of enemies spotted. Is this... Can you fire at it? Yes, please do. Team is firing at them, okay. Canadiera. Nice. Well, the pack 40 is gone. That's good news for us. Move up. Let's move up. Being a bit more aggressive here as the last time, uh, being too cautious. Will, might cost you the, the the map again. Then again, being too aggressive will also lose a lot of men. But I've got a feeling that we can. We have some troops here, but not too much. Not these engineers need to up here. Yeah, let's let you guys move down. Seems to be an overabundance of troops here that I need elsewhere. They are being they are being fired upon from from there. Okay. Let's shoot at the, at the muscle flash. Alright. Concentrate your fire, mate. MGT, no, uh. Yeah, move fast. Let's have these guys move up. Let's have these and the grenadiers are not yet dead. They're not quite alive either. These guys have died, unfortunately. There are. Yeah, you're taking fire from the gun. That's fine. Just the rifle team that I moved up and and then yeah. 
Ah, good. The grenadier surrendered. Okay, good. Let's get scared the scare the living shit out of these guys. Uh, can't smoke, get him. Close combat, real close combat situations, the Germans are still better than the others. They're just more trained, more disciplined, and hand to hand combat is not something that anybody enjoys. And I guess being on the losing side just makes you just a tad more scared of your life. I don't know. I don't talking complete bullshit here but they are uh, very difficult to beat on the very close uh, combat situations this is the surrendered guy fine can you concentrate your fire on the grenadiers here yes you can you too and I can get fire apart that's nice A lot of extra movement to take the causeway again. Let's sneak those bosses up. Why don't you throw the smoke? Come on. We have to flank them. Those are just going to be suppressed. Fire at these buggers, might be far away, but they're in plain sight. These grenadiers are no longer, which is nice. They've taken the victory location, that is less nice. Rifle team running low. Yeah. Okay. We cannot fire upon it. Can we fire upon it? This is a great situation for a tank. Just roll in a tank, you blow them to bits. Uh, yeah, we are. As far as morale goes, we are winning. I'm just gonna move these guys up because it's freaking pointless here. Uh, we got one. Alright! There was a little tank! And I emphasize the was. <laughs> the little tank is burning. And there's another t little tank here. Okay. You know something? Let's move fast. Let's just assault that. I doubt it will work. But I am not a patient man today. Granata! Okay, that was pretty intense. It worked! Nice! Did not expect that. A zoog troop also that this is nice. This is going really really well. Let's have 
these guys move up. I am happily surprised. I think these guys right the team is running out of ammo. That does not really matter. Can we take out take out the tank? Yes we can. Oh no uh the tank. No, not sneak. No, 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 no. Fire. Yeah. Nice. Blow the tank. Yeah, we're busy. I understand you're busy. Still blow up the freaking tank. Got a few of mine, point twenty eight. One is still mine, so we have the top band here, which is nice. They did not deploy here, but uh, I want to take in the causeway. That's not that bad. Because they will have to retreat soon. Come on, blow the tank. This is useless team, and the tank is KI. But is it also fully destroyed? I think so. That's good. gonna be a suicide mission for the bazooka team either they will die a hero or they will uh, just, <laughs> just die uh, do I still have I'm out of ammo okay that was to be expected let's move up uh, you can still smoke of course smoke That tank hasn't moved in a long, long time. In position, nice. Right, the team can move up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're out in the open. Shoot them. No ammo. Okay. Ah, shit. Mm. I'm not sure if I should be happy with this. Because they routed, but they didn't... We didn't succeed in capturing all the uh, the victory points. Only the farm is still in the farm, and I think this is the road to the next area is still in their hands. Still, well, this tells the story, doesn't it? Officers, five killed on the German side, zero on the Allied side, three wounded, two Allied officers wounded. But the infantry, 19 infantry were killed, 10 were wounded, three Allied infantrymen were killed, and five were wounded. Armor, well, one is complete completely destroyed the other one apparently was just 
standing thus it's neither destroyed nor damaged nor captured uh, the weird thing is there are for some reason no prisoners when there were guys surrendering I'm not sure it might be that he still got shot I'm not sure and one gun was destroyed for on the German side which is nice all in all it, they suffered the the losses that I want them to suffer our uh, our casualties are acceptable all in all it's a good battle but we should have been able to do more here and uh, this is purely the game that generates this after uh, the battle ended I do feel that we should have been able to at least secure the, li uh, uh, the line up here nonetheless we're making progress thank you for watching and until next time